Hey guys, it's Bumpkey Boy, and we're back playing No Man's Sky. <laughs> oh, not enough launch thruster. Well, that's one stupid way to start the game. Let's see if we can get a little launch action up in here. Do we have no warp cells? We're, oh, we don't have any warp cells? No, I was going to go to another galaxy one of these days. Not today, I guess. All right, let's go ahead and use this up in here. Now we can launch. We just hit this transmission, and it's saying that there's a shelter. So we're going to go check out the shelter. Let's see here. And we're going to go out, and we're up this time, right? Thank you very much. Shelter's this way. Man, I was reading some stuff about No Man's Sky where people are trying to return the game. And I've seen some tweets where people really hate. I'm going to say hate. They, they act like they hate No Man's Sky, the type of words that were used. I really love the game. I think it's fun. You can explore. It's endless. And as long as there's no technical difficulties, we're good. I had a little save problem at the very beginning, if you remember. But outside of that, I mean, the game's fun to play. And uh, honestly, it's probably a really, really fun game just to go and go and go and just enjoy yourself. Planetary interference. Thank you very much. Let's go a little faster to this shelter. But yeah, I'm going to continue to play No Man's Sky. That's all there is to it. Uh... I enjoy it. I think it's fun. And I think there's content here. If we get tired of doing one thing, then we're just going to do something else. Like, uh, we might then start... Can we land? Ooh, 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 ooh. Give me the landing. Can we land on there? Oh, did we overshoot it? Come on. There's a landing platform and you can't even hit it. Is that true? Oh, I think, I think we're on it. Oh, we hit it. Ah, great job, monkey boy, great job. Before we go in there, I want to check out what's around here. We're on this planet that uh, there's some cool stuff. We already found some pretty cool mushroom-looking stuff. It's green, but there's a lot of acid rain, you know, that kind of thing. So let's see what there is around here. Now, I've got quite a bit of technology that we learned, and we've been upgrading some stuff. Let's see, is there anything else in here that we want? I don't think there's anything in here I can do. Interact. Device. Shield at maximum. We can do that. That's good. Alright, let's check out what else there is around here. I'm going to go inside. I think what we really, really need to work on is getting slots. Oh, that's cool. Okay, a new technology discovered. We love new technologies because I'm really not that smart. So I need to learn all the technologies I can skit. And I'm not smart either, so there's some malfunctions word. So that way, if something malfunctioning, somebody can at least tell me probably aliens are going to use it in a weird context. But I think I'll be able to understand. Now, that guy right there, as we know, will allow us to do a transmission. What are you? Oh, new technology discovered again. So impact beam towel, that's great. We love those. I like these little mushroom guys with these arms coming out. It looks like it's got a double head. I think they're pretty cool. I already scanned them. Can I scan you way over there? Or is that way too far? Yeah. I need to do some upgrades, that's for sure. My multi-tool, I need it bigger. Um, platinum, I'll take you. If we can get our multi-tool a little bigger, we'll be happy. All right, before we go into this thing, because it'll probably send the transmission signal out, we're going to save, because sometimes a stupid game, <laughs> I know, I like the game, and I just call it stupid, will tell you that it's right here, right outside, and that's kind of dumb, really. But if you, hey, you just play the game. And if the game says this, then you do, you just got to do it. If you're not smart enough to remember, it's your fault. Does that sound negative? <laughs> I mean, I'm just, yeah. Uh, I think it's fine. We're all good. It's a fun game. All right, let's check out this place. What's in here? So, what we want, we want exosuit slots. We want multi-tools. And I would, I would be great and happy if I found me a new ship I'd, I'd be really happy with that too oh there's stuff right there let's not forget to get that wow all right dude we are in oh no 
No way. Be good to me, please. No, no, no. Be good to me. What you got? Come on. Come on. Tell me what you got. 12 slots. Compare. 10 slots. <gasps> oh, now uh, the configuration looks a little rough on this new one. But I think, I think, I think we want it because we're just, we need to increase. We just did it. Oh, I was supposed to transfer stuff over? No? Oh, uh, not on that. It's fine. I almost felt bad for doing something stupid. There's a trading terminal here. All right, let's check out this multi-tool real quick. Dude. It's pretty cool. Oh, we got a little increase on our bolt caster. Our scanner is a plus three on range boost. We can check things out from afar now. Mining beam, and then we got a beam intensifier on that. That's pretty cool. Maybe what we would need to do is we just need to like beef it up. Can we do other stuff? Oh, we don't have that guy. We need we need we need a analyze visor for sure. See it. Ah, the way this is set up, it won't leak up very good. These guys are are happy together. But the rest of them aren't touching, so there's no bonus. What else can we do just for funds? We can add the scanner, but I don't know if that's really important. Plasma launcher would be cool. Focus Sigma. I like that. We just did a focus. We're focused. What else is here? What is this? Right? Range boost. We already have range boost towel. And here's Sigma. So is that just the levels? Yeah, it's just the levels. Uh, we're going to talk to this guy and then we'll we'll get some more stuff together to craft some more. Sup, bud? How you doing? Warrior Setio. Oh, we know weapon and death death. These guys are kind of mean. I don't know if I like this place. So basically, I panicked and all that. And an angry recorded message is playing. It's a sequence of furious barks and screams that clearly have a moral high ground. <laughs> That's great. The life form sees the battle scars on my exosuit and instantly yelps a question. What? I don't know. Then I'm gonna accept whatever. How'd we do? I'm a good decision maker, right? Compare. We just went from a 10 to a 12 to a 14, and this one's laid out a lot better. They look exactly the same. This, oh man, this guy's a bro. Let that be a lesson to you. Never turn down something that gives you more slots. I know the arrangement of the first tool wasn't very good, but then the second one came with two more slots, so I got four slots in that building just now, and the arrangement on the second gun was a lot better. So the multi-tool, all right, check that off our list for today. I think we did a good job. Now we want to find some suits, right, some exosuit slot upgrades, and we're going to need to find us a, a ship. So we need to make a bypass ship. How do we make a bypass chip? Well, we've done it before, have we not? And what are we gonna need? Ah, uh, plutonium, we're only one short. What, what? Let's do a scan. What does plutonium look like? It's like a red little thing. Oh, it's right here, isn't it not? But there's sentinels uh, all the way over here. Okay, is that enough? Before somebody comes, scans my face with their gun. All uh, right, let's go here. Let's go make this guy. Let's make a transmission right here of this. Now, from what I understand, the only thing good about this guy is just the transmissions. Because what it'll do is it'll take us to a transmission place. And transmission places are where it's going to tell us about crash ships. So there's a beacon. It's 10 minutes away. My goodness. And there's a little uh, language thing there. We'll gather some language on the way. This guy just taught me a word. That's cool. So I know 30 words now. I'm getting up there big time. All right, so let's take a look here. I'm thinking that maybe we could do maybe a little upgrades on this guy real quick before we go over to our next 
so we can do a range boost. I'm just gonna do it, man. We're just gonna do it. I mean, shoot, all this stuff is gonna be crazy because it's gonna continue to grow. We're gonna continue to get multi tools. We can't, we can't wait for anything around here. All right, so what else can we do? I'm gonna go ahead and do that guy. Is there anything else? So that's cool. So this is a reload, which that's always nice when you're gathering stuff. You know what'd be really cool? There's a bolt caster amazingness right there. This would be amazing if we could get ourselves some copper. Check that out. All right, so we don't have enough right now to do anything else. So let's just go on with our day. Let's go over to that beacon thing. What is that? I don't know if I've ever seen anything like this. Is there anything we can do with it? I want to check it out. And I just was talking about I never had problems with the game. Yeah, we're having some problems with the game. It keeps telling me Iridium. Why did I just get hit? Who what? What was that? Something just... I don't know. <laughs> Do it again. Hurt me again. <gasps> this seems important. Let's take some... Oh, yeah. I don't know how much I need, but let's take some till we decide we don't need any more. Yeah, so it keeps telling me to go back and forth between two points. I did multiple saves, and it just did not save. Oh, my gosh. I think we're going to end up fighting you. No? Okay. I don't want to fight you then. So it's telling me to go back to the shelter that we already were at, where I got the two multi-tools. So... You know, this is good for now. Let's um, let's see if we can figure out exactly why this thing's not saving the points that I'm clicking on and take me to somewhere else. I think what we might need to do is exit the game, get back in, and then we'll uh, we'll see if we can find a new point to start in again. And is today our lucky day? I might have fixed the save points by uh, exiting the game. Aha, this is what we're looking for right here. Now it shows there's another shelter, but I think it might be like off planet or something. I don't know, it's kind of crazy. Oh, a suit upgrade, like a slot in the suit upgrade. Where are you? I want you so bad. Can I, can I, can I, can I? How much you cost me? Oh, one slot for 10,000. See, I need to find a lot more. They're still really cheap. How we doing? And yes, there it is. Love it. Okay, cool. Let's go ahead and save this. Where are you? Anything else good around here? You know, another thing we can look at just real quick to see if we have some things like there's the planet and there's a waypoint. What's this one? Does it say what it is? Name. Yeah, that's the shelter. Okay, so we're doing good. And it did save a couple of the uh, pretty looking f plants. So let's go ahead and upload these. I love it, love it, love it, love it. Give me some coin, galactical coin, let's go. Anything else? What else? Oh, yeah. Oh, it's not empty this time. Maybe I just had like a little problem with some stuff. <gasps> 30,000 Galactica coin received. Ah, that's good too. Where's the ship? We found ourselves a new place to check out. Mm-hmm. Get some of that and uh, check out what's in here. Uh, we discovered, yes, impact damage towel. That's great. Wonderful. And language, please. Absent. Absent-minded. Not much longer because I'm learning all the words. And get some of this. And we're going to get some of this. And then we're going to come over here. And we're going to talk to this dude. What do you want to say to me today? Console Schwab. We know warrior isotope isotope. That's good. The bomb needs fuel for ignition, which must likely blow up the vault while wide open. The warrior impatiently tries to explain what should happen next. 
Um, I can't give him this because I don't have enough, but I'll give you some rare of this. Oh, is he happy? I took damage. Great job. That was a good choice on my part. Fantastic. Oh, we get to play this game. I love this game right here. Now, this hopefully will tell us where a crashed ship is. Oh! Journey milestone accomplished! Met 15 aliens now. Man, I got all kinds of friends. They always punch me usually, but <laughs> it's fine. All right, this should tell us a crash ship. You can be cheaty if it's a Gek one and do it over and over and find lots of crash ships, but we're just going to play the game. So we got 4634, 6344. All right, so it's just taking the first number and putting it at the back again. So it should be 4463. That's my guess. That noise always sounds like you messed up. <laughs> <laughs> Haven't messed one up yet, cross your fingers. All right, talk to me. And what are you and where are you? So I discovered some wetlands and I'm not sure exactly what just happened. Let's go out here and take a look around. So there's something over this way. I'm going to go look. So there's something that way. And there's something this way. Uh, let's just go to it and see what it is. This crash ship stuff is not working right now. Now, I can't remember if this is my fault or if it's the game, but if you look at that planet, it looks like there's a couple places to stop. And at this planet, there might be a couple places to stop. So, I'm not really sure. It's, like, really bugging me right now that if the game is, like, giving me a hard time, uh, I'm going to be a little bit frustrated. But let me keep playing and try to keep track of what I've done. I thought I grabbed all the little things. I don't know. Oh, this looks like fun. We went and learned some words, and now this has come up. There are three vast columns of words of ancient structures, each written in a different alphabet. The first column's words are like savage ruins scratched in sand. The second shows precious sequences of dots. The final column has wide and welcoming letters, almost appearing handwritten in hard stone. The dirt and blood of ancient hands prints covers the base of each column. Which one do we want to do? Um, I don't know anything about the ruins, the dots. I'm not sure. I'm going to do the letters. I want to learn some words. Oh, something cool happened. It goes up and... Oh, first... I learned another word and we continue yes <laughs> another exo suit slot gotta get your slots man inventory is getting a little less and a little less tough oh yeah I'll put one down right there for 20 galactical coin all day every day yeah the, these are my favorite for sure we get to destroy the door to go in. Why wouldn't we like this? Let's do it. Bam! Of course, we're going to have to fight a little bit. Reload. Okay, Sentinels, where are you? Because I know you're not going to like this. I see arrows on the screen. Oh, there's one. No, 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 no. Ah, we got him with the beam anyways. Okay, who else are you? Um, can we do this and then reload? Let's use the big bad gun. Why are they not coming out? If you're going to be stuck behind there, I'm going to shoot the door. Make you mad. What, you can't come get me? That's fine. I'll play your game. Come on, blow up. Yeah, now what, Sentinels? You want to go? I'm ready for you. 
Let's reload. We're gonna go ahead and show our face. Are they inside? No, there's one. Uh oh. Oh, there he is. Oh, this is gonna be sick. Get him. Reload. No, 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 don't be hitting me with that laser, you jerk. Destroy him. Get him. You got him. Oh, shut up. Get rid of this stuff. No, no, let's go back. Let's get rid of this. I know. I'm just trying to stack, lady. I'm just trying to stack. All right, let's see. What do we got here? I know there's another sentinel. Ooh, a module. Where was... There he is. Oh. Interact. Already known? What use is that? Okay, where's that other guy? Let's reload. Is he hanging out behind the house? Or is he inside the thing? I'm gonna... I'm just gonna go in. I don't know where he is. Look at this thing. What is this? Oh, wow. This is super cool. I know. You want to know too, but for me... Sentinel force detected. Okay, all right, let's see what we can do. The alert has obscured the information on the primary terminal. I can only make out a few words. If I can work out what was being worked on here, I can restart the workflow and restore operations. Warp. Uh, Starship. I failed to access. Oh, man. Can I go back in, please? Oh, I failed. I could have got something really cool, I'm sure, and I failed. Well, that's a good way to end the episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed the episode. We're going to do a few more of these that were going to be pre-recorded while I leave town. And, uh, yeah, so look forward to those. We'll catch you guys later. Have a good one. Bye-bye.